Uh, hi, I'm Eugene Gambi Angelo. Uh, I'm Kenyan and I'm a professional, semi-professional football player at the moment. Uh, I've been playing football since the age of six. My ultimate goal, as far as my playing career is concerned, is probably to, not probably, definitely to win the biggest trophies or definitely to play in one of the top five leagues or the best, one of the best teams in the top five leagues, which is definitely England, Spain, Germany, Italy or, or France. So if I get to play one day, not one day, definitely part of my season, my football at the highest level and contest for the best trophies, donning the colors of one of the best teams in Europe, that would be uh, the biggest goal ever. Yeah, uh, for, for, for me, when I started playing football, my fondest memories are playing uh, at where the first place where I was born, the first township, which was which is in Mombasa, where I've been born and raised. Uh, it was at a, at a township called Bombolulu, but we'd just uh, we'd always rock up after school, after church, just any time you had off and my fondest memories and definitely my love for the game definitely all would be summed up with its scoring of goals or winning against uh, the other team on the day so getting the bragging rights but mostly the, the feeling and the, and the feeling and the sense of accomplishment that comes with a goal at, at the way is where I derived where I love the game from, from the beginning. So in terms of how long I've been playing, definitely those were the most, my earliest memories of playing football. Uh, pretty much my older brother would be there when no one would come and play, we would play something at home. Maybe it's sometimes still the wee hours of eight, and it doesn't matter with a, plastic, with a ball made of plastic bags or tennis ball, those are my fondest memories. In the morning, and normally I, freshen up then uh, pack up so I pack up what I need definitely personal effects needed uh, on the pitch like cones uh, boots definitely running shoes if I'm having a, a bit of a of a jog before and then normally have everything also including the yoga mat which is important for stretching before and after the session uh, and pretty much I think uh, that's it and mostly my training normally revolves around this three facets uh, so it would be uh, cardiovascular fitness uh, and definitely uh, technical uh, ball work and then the third one on the field would be uh, mobility on the days it's technical I'd have drills centered on my position. So because I play three positions, which is I can play both wings and as an attacking midfielder, each each session on the day depends. So one day I'm one day in the week, two days in the week I'm doing uh, wing related, definitely a left wing or right winger related sessions. Then on the other day I'd be doing the midfield, the midfield tailored uh, session. My biggest challenges would definitely be, I'd say, definitely facilities being deficient of definitely like personal effects coming from a family that wasn't so very supportive or able to support. Uh, that would be a big challenge for me. So I had to uh, not only improve myself on the pitch, but also had to be very uh, grounded in terms of uh, especially keeping your mental well-being uh, and having to provide for yourself uh, within this journey. Some days I had to, we had to eat less with, with my roommates, uh, had to work definitely two jobs, definitely casual side because I wasn't qualified for the jobs uh, 
those would be the biggest challenges and then my passion and ambition and resilience I feel is what put me to where I am. So it, um, it's, it's a journey where I'm not complaining and I'm definitely happy. Thank you.